Investigators are wrapping up right now after obtaining a search warrant for a home on Seneca Drive in Trinity. Now, investigators search both inside the home and also the wooded area surrounding it. The man that lives inside this home is the same person that reached out to Taylor Haynes family when he hadn't seen or heard from her. The family immediately filed a missing persons report that was back in July. God's protecting her and we've just got to find her. A desperate plea from Taylor Haynes stepmother and mother, both parents putting their faith in investigators. At least a lead to point us in the right direction. Investigators on Wednesday taking a step forward in the case after the Morgan County Sheriff's Office got a search warrant. We continued to uh, speak with anybody associated with her uh, from the people that were with her last to the people that she may have communicated in the days prior to going missing. Several leads from the public giving Morgan County investigators more information on Haynes disappearance. We're talking about areas around Trinity to uh, Bankhead Forest in Lawrence County. Uh, there's a Coleman connection. Uh, there's an Eva connection. There's a Hartzell connection. So uh, this is kind of the geographic area. Haynes family says they have very little information as to where Haynes could be, but they feel she is still out there alive. I feel like she is still here somewhere. Where, I don't know, but I know she's here. In Trinity, Olivia Schuler, Way 31 News.